George, the French and Indian War was too costly for us to recover from. Something must be done. Well, why not tax the American colonies? It was on their land anyway, so we should make them pay for the war. But your majesty, I think the colonists will not be happy by this decision. I don't care. We have no other choice. This is too much. No more taxes. No taxation without representation. It's time we showed these British what we really think of their taxes. <laughs> what do you have in mind? Shh! Wait for the signal. Go! Board the ships now! Did what? This is an outrage. Order troops into Boston. I'll show them to defy their king. Ah, uh, there goes the neighborhood. How dare they? King George is willing to come to blows and force us to submit to England's will. His tyranny cannot be tolerated anymore. Fellow delegates, please hear me out. We must issue our own Declaration of American Rights. Give me liberty or give me death. Hear, 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 hear. Turn out! Turn out! The British are coming! Turn out! They're on their way now! Turn out! Turn out! Hey. Outnumbered. Yes, but we have to make our stand here and now. Thankfully, we got fair warning from Paul Revere. But will it be enough? Step lively. Load your weapons. Fix bayonets. Throw down your arms, ye villains, ye rebels. This will be your only warning. So take heed. Farmers against soldiers? We can't lose our nerve, not now. Hold fast, lads. Hold fast. Don't fire unless fired upon. But if they want a war, let it begin here. So begins our dangerous journey towards independence. But how will it end? To find out what happens for yourself, read our book, What Was the Revolutionary War All About? This title is part of our series called The Revolutionary War. Or come to our website, enslow.com, to see the other books we have on this interesting period in American history.